in the implementation of minimum wage. My people, my people, this new minimum wage matter, where be said the federal government, it don't sign into law, so make they pay the money. You can't see say up to now. They never see start to pay the money. Oh. What did they come they let the common as they know? Especially those who be say that they work for the government sector. Now be say they go pay area so. You can't see say all this one so be say that they talk so. Some states, at the end of it, they no go see pay the areas. And even to over implement the new minimum wage. Now issue for some of the states so. And a good say of a truth, as our federal government don't sign this new minimum wage, make it be safe for federal level, they don't even start to pay. Now the state, now it can remain. But you see, say up to now, nothing don't happen, no. So my people, my people, that one go tell you the kind of leaders we be say we get to. On our come here, add the report. Follow. The Pentecostal Fellowship of Nigeria, PEA, they can urge President Bola Tinibu to make a hurry up to implement the new minimum wage where we say is signed before now. The PEM, through its national president, where be Bishop Francis Wale, can admonish the federal government to rule out, roll out the system by which it will be implemented. Adding that Nigerians have found themselves in a situation where everything has gone up, including prices of petrol products, transportation, and food items. Addressing journalists yesterday, after PEN's National Advisory Council, NAC, meeting, at PEN National Secretariat in Lagos. You can see Francis can urge federal government to make the refineries work, condemning the idea of importing fuel into the country. Francis can see urge Nigeria to their support and Liko Dangote's intervention in the country. He can say beyond the minimum wage issue. He said, "Make Nigeria refinery still work, and make a Dangote's intervention make it survive." With the way it be so, he sure say Aliko won't only use his words to help Nigeria. So, and with this one, he not good made a frustrate in effort. Oh, he good say make all and be on deck to bring down the prices of petroleum products because not only transport costs now go go down. Oh, so many other things that go still go down oh, and life go come day easier for Nigeria. So speaking for now, the PEM president considers the federal government say make it revisit the Ajekuta Steel Complex. So he can say Nigeria don't suppose go beyond the situation where it be say this country that go to import spoon and plates. Among others, so as it be said, the Ajokuta still complex is still dead there, it not makes sense. So, of a true so, if the federal government feel make the Ajokuta still complex work, it go really affect the economy in a positive manner, and it go also want the federal government to create jobs for the restive youth. So, Reminded the government that last protest was a wake-up call for them to do something good for Nigeria, so especially the youth. For the rest of youth, the federal government make it create job for them. If, for example, the federal government can create a system whereby cottage industries can be established in all the 774 local government area that can employ 500 to 1,000 people that will take off unemployment list and they will be productive. 
it get other areas. The Christian body wants the federal government too to do something. He say federal government make it build up the value of the naira. It's of a truth. If you if you not go feel imagine for a life, say one thousand dollars, go come they buy over one point five million naira. He said before now, things not be like this. He get away be say this uh, naira come almost the equivalent to two dollars. But the way it can't be so, we don't date time now where be say one dollar go come buy over one thousand five naira. And you can see say the government never they do anything, no, which is not good. You can't say when we disvalue our money, we disvalue our life. So or say the recent protests is a wake up call for the government to for something to be done, no. And even up to now, you can't see say the federal government no still find solution to the reason why the protests happen. No. And with this one, it good made the federal government plan well for the youth, especially, so that that mind of running out of this country to another country, you know, go come dead. Down. Finally, you can't urge Nigerians to be patient with President Tinibo led administration no, saying we know that nigerians are going through economic hardship and struggles oh he said of a truth they still they feel the pain of what did they happen for this nation no. what did they get to do now to pray and make sure say this kind of thing you know go last for too long ago my people my people of a truth this hardship matter where be said there for grant for this country so na serious one no oh. because the way things come they increase every day it can show say the government it be like say they're confused on their own part so now make you see say the government no fi put down any good measures to then make this situation they easy small especially among the ordinary nigeria so you can't see say with the way the things they go, if you continue like this, you know go there good though, you know go see there easy for the government too. Because the truth is that who the lead group of people, if the people not there at peace with her, that leadership position where the person there, you know they see there easy with her more. So may the government try possible best, make it find solution to this hardship matter where be say. A day for Nigeria. So, my people, my people, I wanna see the matter. In not pass so. This na bliss channel. I beg make on not forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.